Hey guys, thank you so much for tuning into the short video. Once again, this is Anthony Hendrickson coming at you here today. And the last couple videos that I've done have been kind of all along the same things. It's kind of that working from home type deal since we've all been doing that for quite a while now. But I want to switch it up a little bit. And kind of what I want to actually do with this one is talk about, you know, those times when you might be feeling a little bit stale. You know, you feel like you need to change things up a little bit. Well, that's exactly what I want to focus on in this video here today. Is actually what I want to talk to you about is the three ways to improve um, those stale situations, just make them a little bit better. Uh, if you see me looking over here, you might see me glance off to this direction a little bit, trying a different setup. Uh, I do have some notes over here too, so if you're wondering what I'm looking at, it's exactly what I'm looking at. But once again, these are, are what I want to talk to you about in this video today. Is just three ways that you can, three ways or three things or habits that you can do to improve those situations. Sometimes you just gotta shake things up, try a new perspective, that a little bit of agitation will go a long way. So what I want to share with you is just three ways that you can shake things up and how to do it right now. Number one, prioritize honestly. You need to be honest with others. You need to be honest with yourself. When you're going after the life that you want to live, sometimes you need to actually put that out there and, and voice your opinion on that. That way people in you know what you want. And at the end of the day, you need to authentically be you. Number two, be mindful of time. Be mindful of your time. After all, we only have so much time on this earth, so you need to choose that time wisely. So make sure you're being authentic to yourself, going after that life that you want. And at the end of the day, you have to make sure that you tell people no and situations no when it's not really what you want. Time is limited, you need to take the most. Three, make meaningful connections. Create relationships that will continually lift you up because that's those are the exact relationships that you're going to need when times are tough. We all know times are not always that easy. These relationships are the ones that are going to pull you through those times. So those are the type of relationships that you want to reach out to and text them just because. Or give someone a call about them know you're thinking about them when, you, when it actually happens. So these are all just little things you want to do. These relationships are going to go a long ways. Not only are you going to be there for them, but they're going to be there for you as well. So this is one thing that I cannot stress enough. Make sure that you keep those relationships and keep building those relationships because they're going to go way farther than you could ever imagine. Thank you so much for tuning in. So these are just three quick tips on things that I like to remind myself of how you can improve your life and how you can improve your life now. Now, they're just small, simple tips, but these these repetitions and things that we practice on a day to day can go off. Your faces can go a long way. So once again, this is Anthony Hendrickson. Thank you so much for tuning in. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching or listening. I hope this content has helped you in some way. Maybe it motivated you, maybe it inspired you, maybe it actually triggered something uh, in your head to make you get out of that rut or get out of your own way. Maybe it simply entertained you. I'm just an ex-service industry guy who, once I decided I didn't want to live in that fast-paced life anymore, uh, decided to go my own way, I felt like I was out on an island. Everyone who I'd known for years uh, suddenly wasn't around and it was a whole new feeling. After spending tons of my savings, going into deeper debt, I realized that it was really time for a change and there's something I need to do about it. After being at a mental rock bottom, I decided that I had to pull myself up, do something different, and that's how I got into the world of marketing. Now, I've been almost two years removed from the corporate life and I've never looked back. If you wanna follow me on my journey or connect later on or in the future, or even if you just wanna follow me, you can either find me at my blog at anthonymarkhendrickson.com. Once again, that is anthonymarkhendrickson.com. Or if you're watching this video, you can click, click on the link below. Once again, I'm Anthony Hendrickson, and we'll see you on the inside. Okay, bye-bye.